Were you still working on your Christmas gift list because there is an inexpensive way to shop you might want to consider? A recent survey found 49%, just under half of millennials and Gen Zers who responded were okay giving a secondhand gift. Kathy Walsh went to the Goodwill store on Broadway to shop with the experts. Some in my generation have been known to do what's called re-gifting. My kids would get embarrassed. Now they do what's called thrifting, and young people consider it cool. Thrifting is probably the coolest thing you could possibly do. 29-year-old Lexi Wilson scours the shelves at secondhand stores. She blogs and sells vintage items under the name Lexi Goes Thrifting. I call thrifting a modern-day treasure hunt. Stacy Mosco rummages through the racks at Goodwill. A stay-at-home mom, the 33-year-old resells shoes and clothes. How cute is that? <laughs> Stacy finds a number of items with tags still attached. She Googles labels she's not familiar with, and she snags some popular brands. Steve Madden, can't beat that, $4.99. With shoes that inexpensive, it's she could gift a person a whole outfit. Yes. Still have tons of money left in my budget for more. I celebrate Christmas, so I like to call it Thriftmas. Last year, about 90% of the gifts Lexi gave were secondhand. You never know what you're going to find in the thrift store. This day, she hit the jackpot. So I thought this was fabulous. It's a wine set. Six bucks, and Lexi snagged an artsy lizard that holds a wine bottle. Will you give that as a gift? I would, if I don't keep it for myself. Lexi believes thrifting is for everyone. We have so much excess of everything. There's really no reason to buy new if you don't have to. And just when you thought it couldn't get any better, Goodwill has additional discounts on select items every day. So maybe it's time to thrift the gift. In Denver, I'm Kathy Walsh, covering Colorado First.